there is no one that was on that debate stage last night that can actually beat Donald Trump. And I'm going to say that again. You know, there's no doubt in my mind that nobody on that stage last night can defeat Donald J. Trump because they're playing check. They're playing checkers and Donald Trump is playing chess. Now, what stuck out to me last night was Kamala Harris, you know, the AKA side piece 2020, uh, AKA the bed wins the concubine, the woman that's married to uh, not black Doug, white Doug, because we don't know anything about her background or her husband. Now, we do know she was a prosecutor in the district attorney. Uh, we do know that. And a question was asked, what do you regret about doing or what do you regret in your past involved with your career? And she stated and I'll quote, you know, and she stated and I quote, she said, uh, pursuing a career as a prosecutor and district attorney was to be the change. So she said, stating that she, she wants to believe to becoming a prosecutor and a district attorney was to create the change. When I heard that, I was like, man, get out of here with that. You know, I was like, man, I, I, literally, I was like, man, ain't that some, you know what? Because I was confused. I was totally confused. You know, so basically what she's saying is kind of like a drug dealer saying, um, I sold drugs and I sold crack and I got people hooked on crack and heroin, you know, to be the change in the community. Come on now. We ain't buying that. Come on now. We are not buying that. No way, no how. Because the Jewish community is, is, is really pissed off at her and her campaign uh, because she's plummeting in the, in the polls. So clearly last night she um, got some script writers and she had a couple punchlines that she was targeting towards Donald Trump. For some strange reason, they're not going after each other as of yet because the candidates that went after Joe Biden, went after Kamala Harris and questioned her on her record, they were not even on the debate stage because now the uh, 18 to 20 candidates is now down to 10. So now as, it, as, as the candidates shrink and, and they begin to fall off, uh, we're going to vet every last one of them. And like I said, Side Piece 2020, the concubine, Kamala Harris, Joe Biden, uh, the slave master, uh, AKA Sleepy Joe, Cory Booker, um, the, the single president, you know, he's suspect, you know, he's single and he's suspect and they're calling him the house Negro. Okay. Because I've never seen a light skinned, green eyed, uh, a, a brother out there picking cotton. Never. I ain't never seen a light skinned brother with green eyes picking cotton. Nigga, that's massa son. <laughs> that's massa son. 